Hello everyone, welcome back to Pizzeria Simulator. I'm living a bit of a lie. As you can see on the wall behind me, I've got all of the FNAF 6 endings here. But we actually haven't achieved all of them. We still have Lawkeeper and Blacklisted Go. We refer to the Freddy Files. Blacklisted Certificates. If you end the game with a risk rating of 50 or higher and win, i.e. you don't go bankrupt, you're awarded this certificate and can never work for a Fazbear estab Entertainment Establishment ever again. Speaking of books, um, hello? This isn't meant to be out yet. It's meant to be out in two weeks time, but here it is, so. Okay, so the three things that we've got to focus on, right, is liability risk. We need that, as much of that as we can, obviously 50 or more. We need to have money saved so that if we do get sued overnight, we can actually use our money and get rid of it. Third one is don't get any health and safety. We're gonna go ahead and get, get a ball pit. Can I upgrade or is it? I'm just we, yeah. We're not doing any sponsorships. Clean and polish will probably add something we don't want. Um, oh shoot. So we're gonna be good because we're gonna have all of the animatronics of a night time. Like that's just, that's just how it, fuck. That's just how it is. We're not doing any sponsorships. The money is massive. You know, money is incredibly important at this point in time. So we're going to be... I'm, I might try to get some of the achievements. Because if we get some of the achievements, then we get a money value for that. And I think that's important. But somehow, I've been playing this game for months, right? Somehow, I've already played Into the Pit... Oh, almost twice as long as I have this game. Like, that doesn't sound right at all. That, that... I, I, I don't believe that, you know? We'll do Midnight Motorist. Then we can use Midnight Motorist to get some money. Get that bank, baby. You know what I mean? No, but is it... Is it canon that did Mike play these games? Like, you would assume that he must have. You know? So has he seen those secret mini games, or are they only do they only exist for us? Okay, so that went really well. So we can get I don't know if we should have done Candy Cadet. We did. I am the Candy Cadet. <laughs> candy Cadet is my G dog. So what can we do? What can we do? Um, that's big for atmosphere. That's obviously very big for atmosphere. I don't know if atmosphere is important. I think the most important ones are bonus revenue, probably entertainment, right? But if I get that, gum ball swivel hands or whatever his freaking name is. I love Candy Cadet. I love Candy Cadet. Hee hee hee. I love my homie Candy Cadet. Um, so the one we actually wanted was, oh mate, we wanted Ned Bear, didn't we? Freak. Ned Bear brings Afton, though. Ned Bear brings Afton. Da -da -da -da. See, why are these unavailable now? Wait. See, like, this is this is what I'm saying. Let's see. Why is Happy Frog and Mr. Hippo unavailable? But... I'm sure that it, as soon as I get enough money for these guys, it's going to say unavailable. It must be because I haven't got the stage, right? I don't know if I should have done that, but I did. But my homie's up. I fear that this ending and the Lawkeeper ending are going to take quite a while. Like a couple episodes each. As much as I'd love to get them in like, you know, like episode one. Um, it's just so difficult. And especially because I've got to survive all of the night. And if I get to the end of the night and then die, that's so much of my time just gone. So I think it's going to be a couple episodes for each of those endings, especially the Lawkeeper, I think. So just a heads up. I got a bit of a money bonus, bonus for that. Okay, perfect. That's what I wanted. I wanted to get to that next level. Um, and also, it's just good to have a pretty maze. I might add a token. There's some good liability in this one. There's some good liability. And we're going to keep going back and checking some of these because they're going to be, they're going to have stuff. I can't believe that I didn't have the balloon guy. Um, also, I currently have zero dollars to my name, and I'm aware of that. But that's okay, life goes on. If we get Bangkok first day, 
Your oh, restaurant is we actually might, because we've got no risk. Awesome. I feel like there shouldn't be anyone here. Can I just say, character encyclopedia, that is the worst FNAF book there is. I hate it. I have it, but I hate it. I might do a video, like a freaking diss track on it one day, because it's... There's so much that shits me, like from the photoshopping that's terrible, to some of the lore that's not even accurate. Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. It now looks let's like you're just getting focus the hang on getting you through your first week. Shut up. I'm going to... Throw it back in the alley. Goodbye, Molten Freddy. I love you. I'm sorry. That was weird. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great. That should be more than enough. Now let's get started. Dude. On your left... Don't do me like that. Okay. Wait. We're gonna do that whole night section again now. Because it just cleared it for no reason. Your restaurant is now officially Your restaurant open. is now officially open. Yeah, I know. It was yesterday as well. This book has sea bonnies. This book has sea bonnies. They could have just like brushed it under the rug and just gotten rid of that. But no, they, they doubled down and they said, no guys, sea bonnies are a thing. And if you ingest them, they take over your freaking body. But bam, bam. Great job. Ba, 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 ba. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Um, 40 visitors, dub. What the bank? Damn. Oh, 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 ladies and gentlemen. Um. I am gonna buy a pig patch. Unavailable. Ah, because I'm not big enough. Okay. But get rid of you, put Pig Patch on there. But we're gonna to get to We're gonna get that big stage, because we need it anyway. And that's a that's a Oh no. No, actually it went oh. There's gonna be someone in there. Pig patch and Ned Bear. Neodato. Okay, boom, we're going. I'm messing around. Oops. Oh my god, I absolutely went off off there. Uh, we're gonna go and find a new upgrade before we run out of time. Okay. I would argue that I got that, but you know. We're only missing like four bits. I reckon it's probably up here to the left, right? Yeah, there. Um. Um. I feel like bottom right is where it'd be. I feel like I haven't been there too much. But if we go all the way to the bottom, I think it's this one. It is. Oh. Oh, come on. So now I think we get bank in this one. Also, what I do want to mention is that last time, yeah, see, some of the power-ups do actually work. The lightning one doesn't. But the magnet does work, and the, the wall hacks work. Maybe you can complete it. Maybe you can complete it. That would be interesting. I'm sorry, Susie. You've got to lose... you got to use your intuition, darling. I didn't get any money for that! Are you kidding me, brother? Can you believe this? Can you believe we got a jacuzzi? Ooh, okay. We can upgrade. Bam! Bam, bam, bam! Okay, let's do one more candy cadet, see what he's going to give us. Come get your yeah, he gives us a, a story brewing, if he doesn't, he doesn't. Every I do day. want money though, candy. so surely candy. he gives us money. Candy. Okay, thanks candy cadet, I needed that, because what that does is that lets me get... No, it doesn't. What? Why? Why not? Whatever, um, I'm just gonna buy a couple things to try to bump up our numbers. So what's our risk at the moment? Probably like less than 10, right? Six. I think lefties is nine though. So if we buy lefty, then we get nine. Okay, so, 
Bulbasaur. We're just gonna play a couple more Candy Cadets. Maybe I'll buy the speakers. Oh, I was really hoping that he'd give me the rare finds auction. But I also feel like I'm buying too much. Because I need to be able to have some of this stuff be marked down and get a higher risk for it. I haven't heard anyone yet. I feel like... You know, I've had the three loudest tasks on. I feel like if there was someone here, I would have heard it by now. Risk of over 50, though. That's... That is interesting. That is really interesting. I'm thinking I buy Lefty. Because I get the risk of 9. And yeah, it means I lose the salvage value of like 2,000. But also, I might just fail the salvage. In which case, I get nothing. And I'd, I'd probably lose the salvage. Because this is the hardest. Um, so I'm going to buy him. Spend a dollar. No, I think it's $5. Then I get his risk of 9. Crazy. And then I can also get the Rockstars Assemble achievement that I can get money from. Or money than I would have spent. So, it's an investment. It's an investment. I think it's important to do that. Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. Nice try, William. You're not getting in here. Returning visit is 77. I only had 40 yesterday. What's this one? Tempting. Real tempting. Alright, what did we need? I wanted that, but we can't actually get it for some reason. If I buy this, we each, we're gonna need it anyway, and it's gonna give us the rare finds. It's not though. Can I now buy this? I can't. Worth it. Okay, because now we've got the rare finds, which is brilliant, because that's got. Okay, 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 bear with me, alright? Because what we can do is we've got all of the. all these stupid little. whatever, whatever these are. We'll get a, a little achievement for that, okay? See, and we got a grand for that, which is, that's good. Because we didn't really do anything, to be completely honest. Liability risk? Yep. We're getting that. Baby is in there, guaranteed. Or maybe she's in this one. We're going to get them both, though. We need them both. Okay, I'm feeling okay now. I'm actually feeling okay. We're in a good position. We're in a really good position, I think. Lefty as well. Buy lefty. Got lefty, so we put lefty up there. Already, our risk is now 16, and if we place that, it goes up to 17, and we place that, it goes up to 22. Okay, what is it I wanted to buy? I wanted to buy the this, so I need like, 100 bucks. Nothing crazy. That stupid ball pit tower there, then we can actually see it. Play test. I'm gonna put the ball pit tower as well. Okay. Um, we'll put the ball... What is this? This. Oh, that's the ball pit tower. This is... A ladder thing, I guess. Okay, we're not gonna buy anything else for now. We're gonna hold on to all of that. We're just gonna play as much of the money as stuff as we can. Oh, let's freaking try, dog! We get Orville, and we get the these ones, but I reckon these guys are going to get subsidized at some point, and they're going to have more risk, so we're not going to buy them yet. Um, I don't want to play that again, because I did really well, so I don't want to risk it again. So no thanks on that. Okay, it's really not that hard. So my concern is I've got 26 risk right now. So there is no single world where I don't I have the whole cadet. gang come get from getting me tonight. Like they I will, I know it. Day, I know day. they will. Why does the vacuum cleaner move? The rest of them just stand there. That's Bucket Bob in it. Ed Bear can go there, Lefty, you can go over there by yourself. Pop. It'd be cool if you could pop the balloons actually. Because my thought is that this liability isn't going to go away, right? Like, that's going to stay as is. But it's not going to go any less than one. It might go more than one, but it won't go less than one. And I think that that's important. I'm going to try a ladder tower, but without making it go all the back. Uh, -uh I got that. You bastard. If I get rid of all my risk, right? 
I've got a much less chance of getting A, sued, and also having the animatronics rock up, right? Because I'm assuming that this, it decides this at the night time. You know, and yes, it means that my entertainment goes down by a quarter, but at the risk of tripling my risk? Okay, I'm stalling. I don't want to do it. I don't... Fine. We'll give it one go. And many, I reckon there's going to be three here at least. Well, lefty's here. speak. Also, why have I only got one achievement up here? I've got, like, three of them. It's just the plus speed to read one I haven't got. Oh, so it saves that I bought that upgrade to the machine. So that's cool. If I do this, I have enough to upgrade the other things. I'm not gonna do it. No. 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 I'm not gonna do it. I'm better than that. I don't need help. I got this. One issue. Hurry up, dog. Hurry up. Hurry up! Risky. Wait for it to be dead silent. We get it down to 60. Should be fine for the rest of the night. Poor temperature. Get the hell out of me that sound. Yes, it was day three, but there was at least two that we were dealing with there. 
I think it must have been just two. Before it's it's going to say I'm account. already inside. Yeah. I know. Scrap is already here. Don't Scrap Baby comes Saturday. in. You want them all to be in Shut one place. Saturday, dog. Scrap Baby came in through the ladder tower. That's how she comes in. We've probably been sued. Maybe even twice, if we're going to be honest. Oh, good money. Good bonus revenue. I said twice. Fuck. Okay. Okay. Here by complaints against defendant Fesbert, a uh, young girl twisted ankle, Fesbert failed to comply with minimal regulatory standards because of uh, she was irreversibly crippled. And she's not, not expected to recover for at least two weeks. Oh, it did him. Her family suffered severe mental trauma from the sight of their loved one on the ground complaining. Her injury was completely avoidable, but for Fesbert Entertainment, Inc's contumish. Contumish? Uh, conduct in failing to observe regulatory standards. I'm gonna fight that, because I feel like that's not my fault. That's not my fault. Okay. Food poisoning, that's probably... We can't. We probably can't fight that. That's probably on us. Um, Alright, is there anything that's gone down, like, significantly and has, like, a much better... much higher risk than it did? <laughs> Nothing at all, actually. Brilliant. Thanks, guys. I, I love that. Surely, like, Foxy's got, like, eight now or something. Okay, Foxy! Oh, I said Foxy! Yes, I know that that's gonna bring an animatronic, but it's okay, alright? We'll survive. Alright, uh, you get out of the way. Foxy! My boy, my homie. So what's our risk now? Like, 31 or something? 30. Okay. Oh! Return to Candy Cadet. 2000, that wasn't Maybe a... I will tell you a story. Candy Cadet, tell me a freaking story already. Well, really, we don't have to spend any money because... Oh, I'm going to take my headset off because this is going to be the end of the episode. We don't have to spend our money. We've got 2,500. 1,400 of that is going to go to the equipment upgrades in the office section because we've, we've got to do that. If we're going to have any chance of winning, we have to get those upgrades. They are absolutely worthwhile. Um, so we've really only got $1,000 to spend anyway. And yes, I could buy Mr. Hippo and I could buy Happy Frog. And that would complete my mediocre melody collection, except for Orville Elephant actually, who is four grand. But what would I gain from that? I may as well wait, right? Bear with me. I may as well wait until they get discounted. And maybe they won't get discounted, but maybe they will get discounted. Um, maybe they'll go to half price or whatever and have, even if it's, even if it's the same price and one more risk, that's still worthwhile when we are going for the highest risk that we can possibly get. Like. I do want, like, this is doable. We can get this. That's realistic. We can get the Deluxe Ball Picks. So that takes us to 34. I'd love this, but it's really expensive, so I don't think that we would be able to get it. But if we were, that'd take us to 39. All right. So currently, what's in the store as we speak has a would get us to a total risk of 43, which is not enough. So we've got to, we may as well wait. Each day, some things get discounted. And I'm hoping it's things we haven't purchased yet. But first of all, from a financial point of view, that works brilliantly. But also, we need seven more risks somewhere. That has to come from somewhere. And bear with me. I believe that I've already got the most... Oh, no. That'll take us to 40... Did I say 43? If I said 43, then 44. The safety straps, we cannot do, because that is going to get rid of the risk. Or it's going to give us a health and safety. Either way, it doesn't matter. We, it, it, we don't want it. So get keen. We've still got nine tokens to use today. So we can get good money for that and then go into the night section with a lot of money and then go over to the next day section with a lot of money, even more money. So we could be in a really good position. Like there is a world where we buy, I reckon tomorrow day, depending on the prices, we're gonna try to buy all the elephants and the other medium of melodies. And then we can get that achievement, which gives us probably 10 grand, I'm gonna say. Uh, either 10 grand or 4 grand, no, either 10 grand or 5 grand, which either way is going to be helpful. And we can use that to buy more stuff. If it gives us 10 grand all at once, we can probably buy the Gravity Vortex, which we're going to have to get at some point. That's 5. We can't make that 5 up somewhere else. So we have to get that. Um, I reckon it's going to get close. I don't know if we're going to get the 50. I reckon we probably, probably best case scenario, we're probably looking at a 47 or a 48, but we'll see how we go. You don't know how much they're going to get discounted by, so we'll see how we go. But thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate it.